Hey YouTube, this is Raj, and today I'm going to be talking about bees nests in Minecraft, basically where you can find them and what you can do with them. So why don't we get started? So let's talk about bees nests in Minecraft. So bees nests can be found in plain sunflower plains and flower forest biomes. They can be found in either oak or birch trees. They generate in either tree 5% of the time at world generation. And basically these guys house the bees. There are usually three bees per a bee's nest. The bees will be in here when it rains and also at night. They'll come out during the day one by one, go out, find flowers, uh, collect pollen, and then they come into the bee's nest. They'll be in there for about two minutes and then they'll increase the honey level by one. The maximum honey level can be level five where you can collect honeycomb and honey. And other things to consider with the bees nest is that if you try to destroy this thing, the bees inside will come out and swarm you and then they'll try to poison you. They'll hit you with your, their stinger and then they'll die within 50 to 60 seconds. So you want to be careful about harvesting it will also cause them to come out and attack you. So you want to be careful when you're harvesting or you're trying to collect the bees nest itself. So with the bees nest, you want to use a silk touch axe and that allows you to not only collect the nest but also the bees inside of it. If you want to collect either honey or honeycombs, you have to put a campfire underneath so that you can harvest those. So I'm just going to quickly craft some of that stuff up. So a campfire is three sticks of coal and then three uh, pieces of wood. Let's see, shears should be right here. So two pieces of iron. Um, and then the last one is going to be glass bottles. So three glass bottles. So if you're wondering how you can tell um, what level the uh, bees nest is at, you basically hit F3. You can see this one's at honey level one. Uh, and this one is at honey level five. So that one's ready to harvest. So what we want to do is basically put the campfire underneath this prevents the bees from attacking you and what you can do if you want to collect honeycombs is you use the shears so this will uh, draw basically three honeycombs and they just go all over the place so that's basically how you get uh, honeycombs now the bottles would get you uh, honey bottles uh, obviously that one's not ready and that one's not ready but we'll just use this uh, beehive to illustrate the same general idea. And you can see that actually pissed it off because it turned red and it's going to try to uh, attack me if it can. But I think I'm in creative so it won't attack me but it would if, it, if its eyes turn red it'll try to sting me and uh, swarm me and any other bees in the beehive would have attacked me also. So how you collect, if you want to uh, set up a farm and move the bees nest from wherever it is to basically a base or a farm, how you do that is we get a silk touch axe and I'll just enchant this. So there you go. Just have to do that and then you collect it and let's see what it says. It just says bees nest. So basically I can just put this wherever I want. So let's talk about what you can craft from the items you can get from a bee's nest. So you can craft four honey bottles into one honey block. This is a very useful new item and I'm going to be doing a video about this soon. Uh, you can also turn a honey bottle and craft it into three pieces of sugar. You can take four honeycombs and craft it into a honeycomb block. This is just more of a decorative block, it doesn't really have a purpose. Uh, you can take six planks and three uh, honeycombs and craft it into a beehive. So beehives are basically the same as bees nests. The difference is that you can actually craft a beehive. So if you want to create a farm that involves bees and honey and you want to just create a bunch of uh, bees nests, instead of having to transport them, what you can do is craft a bunch of beehives and then set that up for your farm. So this is a better way of uh, setting up any honey or honeycomb farms. Another thing I want to show you about the bees nest that is similar to things like um, lecterns and also uh, cauldrons and composters is that it actually gives out a redstone signal. So if you look at, um, basically if you hit F3, 
you can see what the honey level is so this is a honey level 2 right now so what that means is it actually gives out a redstone signal of 2 so if you put a comparator right here you can actually get a redstone signal out so as you can see it goes up to there uh, and the maximum you can get is a level 5 redstone signal out of this so if you it might be useful for uh, creating a farm the last thing I should mention about honey bottles is that obviously you can consume them. Uh, this basically restores 6 health or 3 drumsticks. It also gets rid of the poison effect. So that was Bees Nest in Minecraft. Uh, if you're interested I also did a video about bees and I'm also going to do a lot of videos on the 1.15 update so you can check out those. If you like this video please give me a like, if you want me to keep producing content please give me a subscribe, you can always have a comment I appreciate that and stay classy YouTube, this is Raj.